her these are full of shit. What are they gonna say to you? Take that off the list. Ooh, a little bump back there. How does a mouthwash straighten your teeth? Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we're gonna be doing a hygiene video. We'll be heading to Ulta, Target, and Bath and Body Works. Might not need to go to Ulta, but I'm gonna see what they got for me because my skin has just been breaking out. I know I mentioned it to y'all in a couple of videos. So with that being said, let's get on to the video. Hey y'all, so just got to the mall. I wanted to go to the Bath and Body Works that was closest to Target out here. I really did not know this one was at the mall. And then when I pulled up, I was like, damn, I'm at the mall. I did not want to go here, but it's okay. We finna be quick. come to the store is that you always want you to buy some perfume when you walk into the mall like girl it smells good but i'm not supporting you that I actually got from Target in the summertime. It's a don't forget list. I mentioned it in my first video and I wrote it on the list because I just didn't want to forget anything and I want to discipline myself. Ooh, it's a little bump back there. Yeah, let's get to it. Q-tips is first. I don't know what that is and if I don't see it, then I'm gonna go to the next thing. Quickly ran outside to grab this. So I'm like, there's no way I could do this without it. Okay, y'all, so I'm in the mouthwash and toothbrush place. So, dang, it's just too much going on. And the lighting here is just terrible. Like, why are they so loud? It's gonna piss me off. I usually get these, but this was 99 cents, so I might try these. I don't know. I'm gonna just put them in. I kind of want an electric toothbrush, but we don't need all that right now. So, toothbrush. If I want to try the pink one, the light blue one, or the green one, because I've had the dark blue one and the sparkly one, but I don't know. If y'all can't hear me, then I'm gonna do a little voiceover. Mm -hmm. How does a mouthwash straighten your teeth? That does not make no sense. This is not braces. Like, I don't know. I think I'm gonna try the pink one. to do in person like i don't like it and i usually get the aqua fresh toothpaste i live by this but i've been seeing a lot of people use optic white from colgate and i really want to give that a try i don't feel like buying six dollars worth of toothpaste one over here is like 4.99 and i know they sell it at the dollar tree too so if i don't get that then i might just take it at dollar tree and this is not really a need i just wanted to restock on some toothpaste body wash section and they don't have anything that i'm looking for so i might just get like dove again or the avena one because i have eczema and i'm not trying to be doing too much to my skin i want to try the body wash from nature room but they don't have it so we just gonna stick with dove about y'all but i always be getting the five blade razors maybe having like shea butter and whole oil so you don't even need to use like shea cream even though i got the eos one but i really use it because it comes with something on it you know take that off the list this target do got ulta in it but that makes my life easier i only need to get one thing closer so hopefully they yeah. have okay y'all we in the black girl section we're gonna get some hair oil from me because i don't have that no more I don't know what the difference is, but this one has like a new packaging and it's cuter, so I think I'm gonna get that one because 
But this one is just to celebrate Black History Month. I don't know. And then this one is just the regular one. But they the same exact thing. They have the same exact stuff on it. So we're gonna get the Black History Month one, even though it's not February no more. But I love my black people, so we can get that. I feel so bad, y'all, because like everywhere I walk, this one lady keeps going to the same section, and I don't want her to think like I'm following her or recording her, but I'm really not trying to do that. Here we are in the stand section. Like really limited at this Target, which is gonna piss me off and gonna make me go to a whole different Target and like put everything back, which I don't want to do because I don't have time for that. They don't even have face wash that I wanted to try, so that makes me want to go to a different Target and restart this whole vlog. So I'm in Ulta right now. I'm looking for the brand The Ordinary and I literally just found it and I spoke about it. See how manifesting work? You better start doing that because it works. I'm gonna get back up on this. I used to use this in high school. I didn't try to get back up on the rose hip seed oil. I used to always only put like rose serum on my face and some lotion. It really does like cure your eczema as well. So if you want to use that, get that. I didn't see that first, but the guy who works at Ultra told me it's right here. It's the one I wanted to try. And I was gonna literally return all this stuff, y'all, and go to a different target. But I'm glad it's here friend was using this the other day and I kind of want to try it out because she said it gets rid of her pimples so spending money here today treating ourselves but that's good it's okay I'm uncomfortable because I don't talk around people but we're in the lotion I'm also what I use on a daily I'm using this gold bomb African shea butter coconut oil and cocoa butter and it's not oily at all and it's very moisturizing but it's very thick I want to get this again but I really want to try to use saran eczema but I'm looking at the price right now this looks like so loud here. I'm looking at the price right now, and it says it's like eleven dollars, and this is nine ninety nine. So it might just stick with what I use because I know it works. And I literally just ran out. I'm at the point where I'm going like this, hitting my hand and stuff. So I'm gonna just restock up on this. Look what I found: hiding whipped shea butter with rose, vanilla, lavender. I don't know if it's black owned, but that's so cool. I want to try that out next time. Never seen this one. Don't don't get this shit. This shit smell like trash. That's the shit that Bath and Body Works with me. That's what that shit smell like. These are full of shit. They just taste good. Especially these. I don't know if they were a few, they were a few, but I've had these. These is good. But I heard these is full of shit, so I'm not gonna try nothing. Hey y'all, so I'm out of Ulta and Target and I'm gonna just give y'all a little quick haul before I head home because I know when I get home, I'm not gonna wanna do it. First we went to was Bath and Body Works. I got hand soaps and I got one hand lotion because I just need one of my purses all the time. The hand lotion I got was Bahamas, Passion Fruit, and Banana Flower. I didn't really smell it, I just seen it and I was like, Passion Fruit, why not? I got four soaps. All the soaps was on sale for $2.95 and that's the only thing I really came for besides plugins. But the plugins, I didn't really like the deal on it. So like, I'm gonna just go to Target and get plugins for the Glade or whatever it's called. That's what I did. I'm gonna show y'all the hand soaps. I had got fresh cut lilacs. I don't really like lavender or lilac scents, but it was just calming and soothing in the moment. So I was like, yes, I'm gonna get that. I think all the scents I did get too is all their newer scents. I got Five by Forest. It smells clean. It just smells like clean linen, but a little fruity to it. I don't know, like a little lemon scent in there or something. This one is my favorite one I picked up. It's Pink Peach Blossom. And yes, when I got this y'all, like it just smells so good. Like it just reminds me of eating peaches in the summer. Like it just smells so good. And the last one, I don't really like vanilla stuff, but I got it. It was white oak and vanilla. It was pretty cool for a vanilla scent. Like it wasn't too much for me. Yeah, it, it's cool. Like, if you don't, oh, it's all over. I need a napkin. Oh, I'm gonna have to use this one first now. The heck? This is ridiculous. A little accident. Nothing too big. 
y'all yeah, i was in target going back and forth trying to find the things that i wanted to find and i could not find nothing like it was just getting ridiculous and all the nature room body washes were sold out which kind of made me upset because i really wanted to try that and i was gonna leave if i did not find my face wash because i was like i know they just not not having everything that i want but this is my first time really like recording by myself in a public place where i'm just where i'm talking constantly i wasn't really used to it but it was cool i had to tell myself like this is what you're doing so do it who cares about these people like what are they gonna say to you nothing it was just weird like they kept being all over the place but now on to target within the first bag i put the cleaning stuff in here i was so glad that they had cleaning supplies right by self checkout because i need some power wash or dish soap for the sink at home and i was just tired of using regular dish soap when you have to keep pouring it like no i rather spray and make my life easier like ugh, y'all know what i'm talking about i also got scrubbing bubbles i need something for the bubbles not the bubbles i need something to clean the toilet because i really love going like this in the toilet i'm tired of using all-purpose cleaner they just keep spraying like yes that's what it's for but i wanted something specifically for the toilet the last thing from the cleaning thing was the unstoppable wall plug-in i really love the breeze wall plug-ins because they just go a long way and they last for a very long time next bag got some q-tips i don't usually use this brand i use the regular brand that everybody knows i don't know what it's called though but my dad uses up and up brand and actually pretty good like they do not feel cheap like the dollar tree ones all 300 counts was like three or four dollars something but this was on sale for 119 so i was like why not it's cheap why not like i told y'all i really wanted the nature room body wash but they didn't have it so i just got the dove sensitive skin they did change their packaging and this was uh how much was it where is the price? Because I'm going to get mad. This was like $6.99 or something. I'm not really sure. I got the Always Pain Liners. I told y'all in like one of my videos. I've been using these since high school. And I was tired of getting like the $1 packs. They used to be 99 cents. Now they're like $1.19 or $1.79. But I got the $4 one because I could run out of these in like two weeks. So I was like, let me just get the big pack. Next, I got some gummies. The hair, skin, and nails gummies with biotin from Nature's Bounty. I never had them, but I've always wanted to have biotin gummies. So I just do better for my nails, my skin, and my hair, you know. Next thing is the Miel Rosemary Mint Scalp and Hair Strengthening Oil. I've used this before. I really like it. I got the five blade razors. I like these better than regular razors or three blade razors because I just feel like it gets a deeper cut. If y'all could hear me in the store. If y'all could not, I apologize for that too. I got the La Roche Pose lippy car ap plus gentle foaming moisturizing wash because i've heard a lot of good things about this the other two like the one for hydrating dry skin i heard that was not it so i didn't want to get that and then the other one is for people with like combination of oily skin i didn't need that so i wanted to get this one because they said this one actually does moisturize your skin with dry skin my aunties used this lotion and i tried it before and it was good so i'm like lotion is good the face wash must be good so i give this a try hopefully this works because nothing has been working on my skin and i know y'all like right this is your skin if you see me in person or anything you're gonna see bumps acne everywhere i don't live like that like i was not a girl who ever had acne so coming to louisiana and my face getting acne all of a sudden or hormonal acne or wherever it's coming from i don't know it's just not for me and i don't appreciate it, it needs to go y'all need to get y'all car in line i stuck with the gold bomb because one it was two dollars cheaper two i just wanted to stick with my thing it's really good for dry skin and eczema if you have eczema like me the toothbrushes was like 6.99 uh kind of pricey but i needed some i never had the pink one i've only had the dark blue one and the whitening sparkly one the whitening sparkly one it don't taste that good but i think it works i don't know Ooh, is it white i don't know yeah this one fights cavities 24 hours strains teeth that is ridiculous how is a mouthwash fresh in your teeth i don't know and improves their appearance fresh and spread so hopefully this one is good i've heard great things about the pink one the light blue one and the green one i don't think i will ever get the green one because it's for 12 hours and the light blue one is for 24 hours or maybe i'm mixing them up because they have a dark green one too this was 9.29 that's pretty expensive for some mouthwash but hey the last thing i got y'all is from ulta i got the ordinary rose tip see oil face serum I used to live by this and i want to try it again because i just want to see an improvement in my skin so i'm just gonna go back to the products that my face used to love this was i scanned two no no i need to go back and get my money because this is 1090 and it says i bought two days for 2180 so no i'm gonna go back in there and get my ten dollars i don't care no i want my money but anyways y'all i think you guys watched my video hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to comment like and subscribe and stay tuned for more and make sure to turn on your post notifications so you are aware of when i upload a video every single time and i'm gonna talk to y'all next time i love y'all